Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'll tell you that how can we multiply two digit number with a single digit number mentally and also a three digit number with a single digit number mentally. So let's start the video. First, we will uh, be knowing a method in which we can multiply a two digit number with a single digit first. And after that, second of all, we'll be uh, knowing that how can we multiply a three digit number with a single digit. So, uh, I'll just take a random number. So, let's take um, 47 multiply by 8, I guess. Yes, okay. So, first we will do with the normal like basic method we usually do. So, 8 sevens are 56, 5 carry over. Then 8 fours are 32 plus 5 will be 37. Alright, so this is the answer. Let me write it here. 376 is the answer now we will be uh, doing with uh, the way which i'll tell you in the video with uh, like with my uh, method which i have found it so for my method what you have to do is first we will multiply 8 with 4 will give us 32 then we will put a symbol like this why we are putting this? First of all, let me tell you that this symbol is known as step operator. Okay, why this is known as step operator? Because uh, you might have seen stairs. Like, of course, you have seen somewhere stairs. But if you, uh, you know, observe them with a st uh, with the, uh, uh, side view, so you will see something like this from the side view. So if a person is standing here, so the person would uh, like... Uh, step here then here and then here and then so on so basically the person is stepping on the stairs okay so basically he is uh, stepping so that's why this symbol is known as step operator so now I hope you all understood that what is step operator now next step we are going to do is we will multiply the 8 with 7 will give us 56 yes now what we will do is we will take both the digit of the first number and just the first digit of the second number and we will add them. So after adding 32 plus uh, like 5 we will get 37 and the remaining 6 we will put it down here. So basically what we did is and uh, let me tell you that we got the correct answer. You can see here this was the answer and we got it correct. So what we basically did is we just multiplied the number with the first digit we uh, have we like wrote it down then we multiplied with the second one we put it a step like symbol in the between and then we uh, we like uh, lo uh, wrote the answer for the number which we have multiplied to the second digit also then what we did is we took both the digits of the first number and just the first uh, digit of the second one and we added them so after adding the, uh, them we got 37 and after like the remaining digit we wrote it down here so that was 376 and that is the correct answer now let's uh, solve one more questions and don't worry if you don't understand i'll explain again and we like we have a lot of questions to solve so let's take um, 89 this time uh no 98 multiplied by um, 6 okay so i have written here first we will do with the method which i have found okay then we will check the like with the basic ones so 8 9 uh, like a 9 um uh, i'm sorry 6 nines are 54 then step then 6 eights are 48 and then we will take both the digits and the first digit of the second number and add them. So after adding these two digits, we will get 5, 8 and the remaining 8 we will put it down here. We will get 5, double, 8. Okay, so now let's check our answer that if we like it is correct or not. So I am going to solve it here only. Okay, 4 carry over there. Then 6 9s are 54 plus 4 will be 58. 
now you like uh, you will feel that this method is easier like the normal one is easier than the which i told you but trust me that you will be never a like able to solve uh, mentally this question by the normal method and like you will feel and you like it may look the like the upper met, uh, one like this method would like it may look you that uh, this is very difficult or very hard but trust me if you will try to do it mentally it will be like you will feel this method is much more easier than this one and of course you can do it mentally let me tell you how you can keep in your mind that 8 uh, like uh, 6 into 9 is 54 then a uh, like uh, 8 into 6 is 48 then 54 plus the first digit of 48 is 4 so 54 plus 4 is 58 then the last remaining 8 would be like you will write it down so 588 is your answer so see how like you can solve this uh, very quickly if you do it mentally okay let's solve one more question then i'll tell you how we can multiply a two digit number with uh, like we have done that that but i'll tell you after that how can we multiply a three digit number with a single digit let's take 34 this time multiply by um let's take 5 okay so this one is very easy three uh, like 5 into 3 is of course 15 everyone knows step then 20 and then 15 plus 2 will be 17 then we'll put a zero here 170 see how quick you can answer this like like if you do mentally also let's check our answer if it is correct or not see this method will always save your time and you will improve yourself in maths also like in calculations also and see how you can you know faster you you can answer this uh, this very quickly but now let's move on to the next topic which is how we can multiply three digit number with a single digit number so let's uh, move to that topic so again let's uh, just take a random number let's take a triple three 333 multiply by um, eight okay eight this time now let's do with the method which i have found first and then we will you know check our answer so this method is a little different from the previous one so what we will do is actually this is called step up bracket method okay i have named this as step up bracket method okay and earlier like uh, the previous one was step up method but this one is a little different because we have to make brackets also let's see this first so we have 8 here 8 multiplied by 3 we'll get 24 we have 3 again 2 times so step 24 step 24 then what we are going to do is we will leave the first digit we will uh, you know make a bracket here to 4 then here at 2 then again at 4 and here at 2 ok now we are going to add them so 4 plus 2 is 6 again 4 plus 2 is 6 we will put this 2 here put this 4 here let's see if this is correct or not ok let me tell you once again what we did is we multiplied uh, 8 with ok all the digits of the number ok we write it here and we put it the symbol of step operator between uh, like we put it between uh, them then what we did is we le we uh, you know left the we uh, didn't use the first and the last digit we just might uh, like add we just added 4 2 then again 4 2 so that gave us the answer i'll explain again don't worry but now let's check our answer is correct or not 8 3s are 24 8 3s are again 24 plus 2 26 2 will be carry over there then 8 3s are again 24 plus 2 26 see 2 double 6 2 I mean uh, here will be 4 ok there will be 4 cause 8 3s are 24 I am really sorry 
so two double six four and two double six four. See, our answer is absolutely correct. And as I told you, you can do this men uh, method mentally because this is for do uh, doing just for mentally. And one more, like one thing I would like to share is that I don't know if you have noticed or not that this will mentally took less time than uh, doing like you know by writing. So that's a kind of fun fact also. Okay, but I know many of you will uh, would not understand yet. So let me uh, solve one more question. So let's do it. Let's take nine, four, two, multiply by three this time. Okay, so nine threes are twenty seven. Step nine fours are what twelve. Then again, step three uh, twos are six. So you. You would do a like big mistake. There is that you will not put a zero here. Okay, so you it's like mandatory to put a zero here and then write the six. Okay, so three twos are six. Now let's solve it. So twenty seven. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. Yes. So we will. Uh, you know, uh, uh, we will not use two and six over. We like here because we don't uh, don't have to use these because this is the first and this is the last number. Okay, so we will not uh, use these two digits. Now seven, like we are making brackets first. Now seven plus one is eight. Two and zero will be like it remain two. Then we will put two here, six here. See, I, like we got the answer. Let's uh, check whether our answer is correct or not. See, nine twos are. I'm sorry. Here is four. Okay. See nine. Uh, I'm sorry. Three twos are six. Three fours are what? Twelve. Two. One carry over there. Three nines are twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Two eight two six. Two eight two six. See how quickly you can answer this. So that uh, that was it for today. And uh, I would suggest you to. revise and practice the method which i told you today like daily uh, almost around uh, 10 to 15 minutes so like it will be in your like it will stay in your mind like always and whenever you will be like in your daily life when you will whenever you would be face any situation to solve these kind of uh, multiplications so your mind will work very quickly because you have practiced them a lot daily so yes uh, do practice them uh, daily like from like to 10 to 15 minutes at least okay